Welcome to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment. The forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd though are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. Well, this is certainly one of the most aesthetically pleasing of all Europe's great venues. It was built in the mid-2000s. It is the architectural masterpiece that is the Estadio José Alvalade. Plenty looking forward to seeing this. A capacity crowd here. Yes, Peter. It's a shame it's only a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I've been prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill, and plenty of tricks, and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. We're up and running. Who do you think this is the old Jim? Yeah, Joshua Kimmich. In many ways, the ultimate modern fullback in that he contributes just as much offensively as he does defensively. He seems to have a great instinctive understanding of when to move forward, and, and that means he rarely gets caught out of position on the counter attack. He should be a key player for this team. Thinking the same, he will be a central feature, no doubt. Shula. There's a clever pass. That's offside. Yes, it is. Goretzka eyeing that space. And the shot! Feigl gets it away. And here's Muller. And it's Goretzka. And here's Lewandowski. Well, they could break here. And well played, he saw that coming. Goretzka. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. That's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Tongan. Otterman. Drives it towards the front. Rafa Silva looking to get on the end of this. Great leap! Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Bayern Munich can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. yet. Ottoman. Weigel. Tries to get it forward quickly. Rafa Silva. Weigel. Sané. 
Sane takes the long option. Thanks to get it away. Kimmich. Could move up a gear here. He's left his man. Has a hit. Miller. Sane. out of play. its target. Plays it out to the wing. Michael. There's the half-time whistle. Both, both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game. Peter, apart from the lack of goals, I really don't think there's there's much to criticise. They've got to keep doing what they've been doing, and eventually they should find a way to the back of the net. Here's hoping for them. And it's shaking off, lacking only in goals. The score, the old net. The action has already resumed here. Benfica can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and Forward to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Tongan with clearance. And now they can launch a counter. And he's away. Has a hit. Good one for that. Sumptuous finish. An absolute joy. The second half. Wonderful, the technique perfect. Oh, look, the keeper didn't know whether he was coming or going in the end, and he just got lost.
Interception. And there goes the final whistle. Terrific contest. Really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal. A match that was going to blow us all away, Peter, but I felt the team did a lot right, especially that well timed goal. So, thanks for tuning back in. That's all we have time for.